I'd like to be a queen of people's hearts, in people's hearts. But I don't see myself being queen of this country. I don't think many people would want me to be queen. Actually, when I say many people, I mean the establishment that I'm married into. Because they've decided that I'm a non-starter. I do things differently because I don't go by a rule book because I lead from the heart not the head and albeit that's got me into trouble in my work I understand that but someone's got to go out there and love people and show it I just don't think I have as many supporters in that environment than I did than I did no. they see me as a, a threat of some kind and I'm here to do good I'm not a dis I'm not a destructive person I think every strong woman in history has had to walk down a similar path, and I think it's the strength that causes the confusion and the fear. Why is she strong? Where does she get it from? Where is she taking it? Where is she going to use it? Why do the public still support her? When I say public, you go in and do an engagement, and there's a great many people there. But who knows? Who knows what fate will produce? Who knows what circumstances will provoke? It's a very demanding role, being Prince of Wales, but it's equally a more demanding role, being king. And being Prince of Wales produces more freedom now, and being king would be a little bit more suffocating. And because I know the character, I would think that the top job, as I call it, would bring enormous limitations to him. And I don't know whether he could adapt to that.